Hi, I'm Jonas St. Pru. And I'm Sophia Check. This is a Penn State Today QuickCast. Thousands of Penn State students graduating this week are heading into a mainly positive job market. Many experts say the job outlook for graduates is fairly good, about the same as last year, but entry-level pay and student debt may be trouble for some. Many students we found taking senior pictures on the University Park campus told us they're excited to move into the working world. Liz Gong is moving to Chicago for a new job. And I'm really excited for my job and it's something I entered there actually over the summer and I'm really excited to continue that and see what's in store for me. As we approach graduation here at Penn State, students that come in are excited about their academic accomplishments, their accomplishments outside of the classroom, and they're excited to look forward to what's ahead. Uh, some are nervous about the unknown that may be uh, putting a plan in place. More than half of the employers surveyed for this year's Job Outlook Survey by the National Association of Colleges and Employers rate the market as good. The survey says business degrees are most in demand. As the spring semester comes to a close, students gathered to remember those who died over the past year. The annual Night of Remembrance was held Thursday night on the steps of Old Main. The University Park Undergraduate Association hosted the event and included a candlelight vigil and a chance for people to talk about their fellow classmates who passed away. A total of 27 students from all campuses were honored at this year's event. Sentencing is now set for three former Penn State officials convicted of child endangerment involving the Sandusky scandal. A jury convicted former President Graham Spanier last month in Harrisburg and his lawyer plans to appeal. Former VP Gary Schultz and former Athletic Director Tim Curley pleaded guilty to misdemeanor. Child endangerment. All three will be sentenced in Harrisburg on June 2nd. And Penn State is changing health insurance providers for students starting in the fall. United Healthcare Student Resources is the new provider. The university says the carrier will offer the same planned benefits. That's all for this Penn State Today QuickCast. For more, go to our website, commedia.psu.edu, to see student-produced news from the College of Communications. Have a great day.